we are given a graph in this problem and we have to answer uh, various questions. So part A wants us to find the function's domain. So we'll start by clicking on this little magnifying glass and now we can find the domain. So the domain is all of the x's that give us y values. So the first x that gives us a y value is negative 4. So it looks like it's going to be negative 4 all the way to 1. That's always left to right for domain. So negative 4 all the way to 1, uh, that, those are the x's that give us y values. And we will use brackets for both the negative 4 and the 1 because they're both included because we have these, these solid dots. So negative 4 to 1, those are all the x values that give us y values. So check answer, boom. The range is all the possible y values. So the smallest y value in this case is negative 4. It's right here. That's the smallest y value. So negative 4 all the way to 6. So the range would be negative 4 to 6. It's always bottom to, to the top. So from, you go from the bottom up for domain. You go left to right for range. So negative 4 all the way to 6. That will give us the range. So let's try it. So bracket negative 4, comma 6. Click check answer. There it is. The x-intercept. So the x-intercept is where the graph intercepts the x-axis, where it touches or crosses. Looks like it's right there. x equals negative 1. Right? That's the x-axis, the horizontal axis. And the graph is crossing it at negative 1. So that should be our x-intercept. So negative 1. And then the y-intercept is where the graph uh, touches or crosses the y-axis. So that's right here where my mouse is. That should be negative 2. That's the y-axis, the vertical one. And the graph crosses it at negative 2. So negative 2 is our y-intercept. Negative 2. Check answer. Boom. And what is the value of the function? So it wants f of negative 4. So that's the y-value when x is negative 4. So here's negative 4. And so the y value here is 6. So that's, that's the answer, 6. Let's try it, 6. Check answer. And that's it. I hope that helped.